Hi, this is James here at LA Mazda, and today I'm showing you our 2011 Dodge Durango. This is the crew edition, so this does have seven seats for possibly seven passengers. As you can see, you have your fog lights, very attractive grille, you got your very attractive wheels on there as well, you got your heated mirrors. As you can see on the door, you got all your power options for your mirrors, your windows, your locks. I'll just hop inside here. As you can see, you do have your auto headlights, so you don't have to worry about your battery draining. Um, on the back of the steering wheel, as you can see right here, you have uh, some audio controls for your radio. And they will also be on the other side here, back where my fingers are. You do have uh, all your Bluetooth options here. You, you got your uh, cruise on this side. We'll just fire it up real quick. Just to show you, no, uh, no lights are on the dash. Only 74,000 K on this vehicle. Um, you do have all your uh, Bluetooth, radio, satellite um, options on here for your uh, stereo. Um, as you can see, you got your USB and auxiliary in, so you're definitely covered there. Um, you got your uh, traction control. You got your reverse sensor, so you can turn it off. Um, you got your dual climate control dual climate control uh, so it's very handy as far as uh, making one temperature uh, higher or lower than the other definitely lots of options as far as that's concerned uh, you got your cup holders here really a uh, couple nice trays you got your 12 volt down there we'll go in here as you can see uh, there is a 12 volt inside this one does run off the battery then we can drop down, there's another tray up here with a, a mini USB port there as you can see. So you can run all your stereo from there again. Uh, we'll just uh, quickly hop into the back, show you the seating arrangement. <coughs> again, you got your power options on your door. Your headrests do plop up and down. In the back you got your uh, air controls there. You also have uh, the fan controls up here. You can set it to auto as you can see. So it will hold the nice temperature in the back. Quick flip of this lever here. Just pull the red one. And up it goes. Very easy access to the back seat. Which is right there. The other one's still folded down. Just leave that up and show you the back as far as cargo capacity. Uh, there's your uh, backup camera. And uh, down here you do have your reverse sensors. So there's is what it looks like with the seat up. So you still have a fair bit of cargo space. And then with the seat down, just a quick left, lift of that lever. And uh, down she goes. Very, very convenient little system. As you can see with the seat up in the front, and these back seats down. You have tons and tons of cargo space. Got another outlet there. You have your built-in uh, flashlight there. You got a nice little uh, storage compartment under here. With your jack and your uh, tools. So if this is, uh, this is all wheel drive as well. If this is something you're interested in, again, my name's James here at LA Mazda. 780-665-5224.